Hey everybody, welcome back. In today's lesson, we're going to be doing a tour of some sorts uh, in my great-grandfather's kitchen. Uh, this will be part one of the household tours. Um, so let's see how it goes. Computer, load the screen. Alright, looks like he's sitting at a uh, computer desk for some reason. He's supposed to be shooting a video for me. Uh, let's go ahead and start the video and see what's going on. Computer, start video. Alright, so yeah, he's sitting there. Oh, he's getting a Skype phone call. Uh, that's interesting. He should be doing a video for me, but we'll see. Oh, he's got some. Okay, computer pause. He's talking to somebody on Skype. Um, computer, let's identify who that is. Computer says that this is Bob the Canadian. Uh, it says here that Bob uh, is a successful uh, English YouTuber. Oh, okay, so it's the same thing that my great grandfather does. He's an English YouTuber. Okay, I don't think this is going to be very interesting for the lesson, so I'm going to let them talk. I'm going to uh, make the camera move around uh, the room. Uh, we'll leave them alone and we'll, we'll learn by ourselves. Um, so, with that being said, let's just get going. Um, computer, please resume the video. Okay, so we're moving around the house. There's the kitchen. Okay, I already see something important. Pause. Perfect. Computer, identify what is on the screen. Computer says that this is called a dining table, uh, or it could also be called a supper table, uh, depending on how how you say it, where you live. Uh, a table on which meals are served in the dining room. Okay, so that's where they eat their food. Okay, computer. Um, I think that's all we can pretty much learn from a, a dining room table or a supper table. So I think we should move on. Computer, resume the video. I do see something interesting next to the dining room table. Um, so let's go ahead and pause. Computer, please identify what is on the screen. Okay, computer says that this is called a blender, a device that mixes things together typically uh, for liquefying food. So you would put food in there uh, and the blades would cut it up so much that it, the food becomes liquid. Mm. Okay, computer, resume the video. Let's find out what it's sitting on. Pause. Computer, identify what the blender is sitting on top of. Okay, computer says that this is called an island. An island. I thought that was something out in the ocean. Hmm. Um, so an island is a freestanding piece of cabinetry uh, that is placed in the kitchen to supplement the countertop space. Hmm. So I guess it's just to give more room on the countertop. Perfect. Okay. Well, let's resume the video. And I do see something else. Uh, let's go ahead and computer pause the video. What is that large device behind the island? Uh, computer identify what is on the screen. Okay. Computer says this is called a refrigerator. Uh, also called a fridge for short. Um, a piece of kitchen equipment that uses electricity to preserve food at a cold temperature. Hmm. Okay, uh, so they must put food in there to preserve it uh, so that it'll last longer. That's very interesting. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and resume the video, please, and pause the video, please. Um, so I see something that's in the island. And I'm curious of what it is. Computer, please identify what is on the screen. Hmm. Okay. Computer uh, says this is called a kitchen sink. A sink in a kitchen. Okay. Duh. Uh, used for washing dishes or preparing food. Okay. So they would clean the dishes in this little tub here, uh, which is called a kitchen sink, uh, or maybe wash off food in there. Okay. Uh, resume video. Hmm. Alright, I see something behind the island that it looks interesting. It's quite large. Uh, computer, please pause the video. Uh, okay, computer, identify what that is on the screen. Okay, computer says that this is something that is called a stove, or it could be called an oven as well. Um, computer says that this is for cooking or heating food. Okay, this must be how they cook the food then. Okay, so we, we learned about how they preserve the food, uh, where they clean the food, or clean the food after, 
Uh, they're done eating it, and also now we're learning how they cook the food. Okay. Uh, okay, computer resume. There's something above it though. Computer pause. Okay, computer identify what that is on the screen. Computer says that is called a microwave oven. Okay, so another oven of sorts. A microwave oven. Uh, is a machine that cooks food quickly using microwaves. Oh, cool. Okay. So it doesn't use heat, it uses microwave. Microwave frequencies, I guess? I'm not really sure. I'm not a technical type for that sort of stuff. Um, computer, go ahead and, uh, well, I do see something above it too. Um, but let's, let's go ahead and resume the video for now. Computer, resume the video. And computer, pause the video. Yeah, we got a better look now. Um, computer, identify what is on the screen there. Okay, so computer says that is what is called cupboards. Um, now it's spelled cup boards, cup boards, but when you say it quickly uh, as a native speaker, you would call it cupboards. So it's almost like cub and birds. It's weird, cupboards, cupboards. That's how you'd say it quickly. Um, an enclosure with shelves or dishes, utensils, or food are kept also. Okay, perfect. So. Um, that's where their uh, eating uh, utensils or plates would be, um, or glasses, uh, and even maybe dried food. Okay. All right, computer, let's go ahead and resume the video. Oh, there's a lot of stuff over here. Computer, pause. Okay, computer, please identify the first item on the left, please. Hmm. Computer calls this a rice cooker or a rice steamer uh, an automated kitchen appliance designed to steam rice perfect okay uh, okay and computer let's go ahead and identify the item uh, next to the rice steamer um, okay so computer calls that a toaster uh, an electrical device for toasting bread slices okay and computer let's identify what is to the right of the toaster uh, okay computer calls that a food processor hmm. uh, an electrical appliance with interchangeable blades within an enclosed container in which food is inserted for slicing shredding or mincing okay so it's kind of like a blender uh, it cuts up the food, but not uh, it doesn't liquefy it. Um, it just cuts it up. Okay, uh, and let's identify what is next to the food processor. There's a bunch of stuff in that container. Uh, computer calls these utensils, so uh, they would all be called utensils. Um, uh, are tools used for cooking, eating, and other useful purposes? So uh, maybe flipping, uh, grabbing if it was too hot, uh, so you wouldn't want to use your hands. Very interesting. Okay, computer, let's go ahead and resume the video. All right, so we see the stove, the microwave. All right. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, we're gonna turn around. Let's pause the video. Uh, so across from the stove is, uh, computer identify what that is. Computer says that that is called a dishwasher, a machine for washing dishes uh, automatically okay perfect and let's go ahead and so the the dirty dishes would go inside the dishwasher uh, and it would automatically wash it so it would sort of uh, you know eliminate the need for a sink I guess so let's go ahead and resume the video uh, okay computer please pause and computer let's identify what is on the screen now uh, okay Computer says the picture is a little bit blurry, uh, but what the computer tells me that this is is an air fryer, a kitchen appliance that cooks by circulating hot air around the food. Hmm, interesting. Okay, resume the video. All right, that should be everything for now. So thanks for watching. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Um, see you in the next one. Peace.
Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please hit that like button. And of course, smash that bell for notifications and subscribe to the channel by smashing my face. That face, not this face. Show some love down in the comment section too, if you feel like it. Thanks guys. Peace.